Heirloom Farms, single family homes a little over half a mile away, 0.8 to be exact, from a very fantastic lake community without the lake prices. Now, if you miss this development and they get all sold out by the time you see this, subscribe because I know where there will be 260 more single family homes very similar to this. So let's check these ones out. Welcome back, my name is Aaron Lanning, your favorite Realtor. Today I wanna to talk about the newest development in Temecula, California, Heirloom Farms. This is near Harveston Lake, which is actually a public lake. But if you are buying 1,800 square feet of a home in this development versus in the lake community, you are looking at an $80,000 difference. I'm gonna put those on the screen here. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? So at this development, we have Sultana, which is a three-story townhome, Crimson, two-story townhome, Valiant, single family detached homes. Crimson is sold out at the moment, and this video will be exclusively about the single family homes called Sultana, the three-story attached townhomes. They will have their own video in my new construction playlist. You can check that out later if that's something you're interested to. And if you haven't seen my video on the $15,000 mistake to avoid when buying a new build, I will pin that at the top. So here you have a beautiful clubhouse for both developments, community pool, hot tub, playground, flex spaces, picnic tables, walking trails, dog park, zip line barbecue area, and the website says so much more. And I do love this development and the location and this build. As always, I'll be talking about the schools, solar, and down payment needed at the end of this video. So up first is residence two at Valiant, which is 1883 square feet, three bedroom, two and a half bathrooms, and two car garage starting at 676,000 as of right. Meow. Yes, I said meow. Now all these homes have an HOA of $145. This specific home, in case you missed it, I do like how you have a little mud room right when you walk in, right at the garage. Good sized pantry and everything in this house, except for the refrigerator, washer and dryer, and the pendant lighting in the kitchen, those things are not included. You're gonna have the electrical connection there for lighting, but the lighting itself is not included. So to clarify, what is included? The extra can lighting, the luxury vinyl plank flooring. Yes, you can change the color of the flooring, the stove, the dishwasher, the built-in microwave, that's all included. Now heading upstairs, you do have to watch for this little yes, extra I step as you get off the actual stair landing, but you have a nice little tech center off to the right, and then bam, that master bedroom right there. Good size closet, little pocket area for makeup for the ladies. Laundry's gonna be upstairs on all of these. You do have special spray foam, helps keeping the house cooler during the summer. And I'm just gonna let you tour the rest of this and I will see you in residence one. Okay, so here we're at residence one, which is 1731 square feet, three bedroom, two and a half bath, two car garage coming in hot at 653,000 as of right now. HOA still 145 a month. Downstairs to me seems pretty much the same. Upstairs a little bit different. Laundry room smacks you in the face when you first get upstairs. Uh oh, Richard! <laughs> Master bedroom is towards the back. For me, the 
it's a much better layout. Definitely think the master bedroom closet is a little bit smaller here and you do not have your tech center. Might be where the square feet changes. Now, your school district is Temecula Valley Unified with your elementary school being Isabel Barnett, middle school is James L. Day Middle, and your high school is Chaparral High School. Again, your HOA is 145 a month. I think I've said that three times, I apologize. Tax rate is 1.75. The deposit to secure a home is $10,000. Unless you are a veteran, then that's $5,000. Now, you can't beat the area. Location is great. You have a lot to do around here, and you're just minutes from the Temecula Mall. They are widening and upgrading that 215, 15 freeway connection. So once that's done, traffic will be so much better. So we are all excited for that to happen. And my favorite place to go around here is the Marietta Hot Springs Resort, which is just a few miles away. So check out my other video if you're curious about the three-story attached townhomes, which is also near tons of new luxury apartments being built in case you can't buy right now and you're just looking to rent. That's all I have for you in this video. Please like, follow, subscribe if this helped you learn more about the area and or the city of Temecula.